Hey guys, welcome back, and today I'm going to share with you top 15 things to do list if you want to grow your YouTube channel. And also in this video, I'm just going to go rapidly through the points. I'm not going to go specifically into detail. And if you want more information for any point in this list, just ask in the comments down below because I probably have that video. So I could just share the link with you. And before I jump to this cool topic, let me do the two quick shoutouts. The notification shoutout goes to Amir to the Future 101. Thank you so much for being first in yesterday's video and shout out to you. And the everyday fan shout out goes to Eddie Plays Roblox. You're always on my channel. I always see you in the comment section. I appreciate it and shout out to you. The first and obvious one is choose a channel name. Be creative, a name that is easy to pronounce and don't copy anyone. So you just want your own original channel name. Second and should be obvious one is open your channel and don't just debate like I'm gonna open my channel six months later just do it right now because every day when you're debating it you can be already making nice videos and number three watch a few videos on each first like how to edit your YouTube videos and how to grow your channel faster so yes you spend some time watching the videos but it actually saves you a ton of time in editing and growing your channel so that will come in handy later on knowledge is very important on YouTube Number four, post videos. As I said before, it's the same with opening a channel. Don't wait for good equipment. Don't wait like what time, what kind of topic am I gonna make my videos on? Just start posting any type of videos you like. Point number five, if you're making videos you like, then you can make a specific niche about it. Like for example, your entire channel is gonna be about drawing if you're good at it. And that's kind of the important part. Being good at a specific topic will definitely help you grow. And you can still be learning while posting videos too. Another thing is customize your channel. Make a channel banner, make a channel logo, make an about section. Because if somebody clicks your channel, they're gonna see that you have a pro channel. Or at least your channel looks really good. And that you put effort to it and it shows. Point number seven, and I suggest you do this, is make a channel trailer. And the channel trailer should be 30 to 45 seconds long, no longer than one minute. And remember, this is your channel trailer, this is your chance to stand out. So make the short video good quality and make it enticing so they're gonna be interested to revisit your channel and subscribe. Point number eight, post a steady amount of videos every week. And you don't have to post five videos every single week, just the amount you're comfortable with and make sure to post the same amount of videos each week. Another point is make sure to improve your audio and video quality, but gr very gradually. And you can't just go from average video level to pro video level in just like one video or two. But if you do it gradually from one video to like 30 videos, then there's going to be a huge difference. Point number 10, research your video and video titles before you even click the record button. I personally use TubeBuddy. There's a few more extension tools, but this is the one I like. I'll include the link in the description down below. This tool helps you with titles, tags, and etc. So people can find your videos easier. An additional point is, and I kind of said this before, but on a different note, is post videos at better quality. So don't just rush seven videos every week that are not good quality and are not edited. Just post two or three videos every week, but at the best quality you could make. Another point is if you create a playlist, then more people will watch those. So if they go to playlists, they can watch many of your videos. And that definitely helps your channel. The only thing is all the videos in each playlist has to be related to each other. Another point is to recommend related videos and in info cards and end screens. Chances are if they like the video they're watching, they're most definitely gonna click that video. And that of course helps your watch time views and etc. Speak about watch time, make sure to edit it the way that they'll watch it till the end or just a majority of the video. Another point is make sure to check your analytics so you can improve your videos more. And if more people respond to one video, then you can do like a follow up video or an entire series. And that will also get some traction on your channel. Now I'm going to give you three bonus tips that are really important as well. And I guess this is the thing not to do. Don't be stressed that your videos are not getting views or they're not good enough or maybe they're not going to get enough watch time. Just go with the flow. And of course, same with subscribers. Just be positive and post videos that you like. YouTube takes some time to grow. It doesn't happen overnight. Don't think, how can I get more subscribers? Think about how can I improve my videos so they're going to be more than happy to subscribe. And the last but not least bonus tip is reply to your comments. You cannot grow a channel if you don't reply to your fans. And if you do these things, sooner or later you will grow. And this is the exact same thing that happened to me in the beginning of my channel. It was slow in the beginning, but now that I know what I'm doing, it's a little bit better. 
And make sure to click this video. It's kind of like a follow-up to this video, but in more detail. And it's the same way that I grow it every time. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.